Discipline The army is the most striking example of a place where the power of discipline shines. It's no coincidence that armies have always been male-dominated spaces. War is a life-and-death situation and the undisciplined army is bound to lose the war. A masculine man can't afford to be undisciplined. If you sleep and wake up erratically, you will have a hard time organizing your life. If you don't have a work schedule, you will not get things done. If you don't have discipline you will get fat. If you don't have a solid training routine, you will never be strong. Discipline is an absolute must for the masculine man. There's no other option. Honor. Have you ever heard the phrase she is a woman of her word? Me neither. Women make their minds through their emotions. Since emotions are fleeting, they constantly change their minds. You have heard the phrase he is a man of his word though, right? A masculine man is a man of his word. A man who can't keep his word is not a real man. He is an embarrassment to himself, his family, and his community. Honesty, sincerity, loyalty, and integrity are all honorable masculine traits every man should have. The need for masculine men. Society needs structure to exist and function. We need both polarities, yin and yang, chaos and order, negative and positive for this to happen. The fabric of the universe itself is compiled of opposites. Opposites attract and give structure, and so do masculine and feminine energy. This is why, typically, feminine women will be strongly attracted to highly masculine men. Opposites attract. Men lead. They protect those around them. They're strong, dependable, and take action. What you can do. Physical training. Get yourself active. It doesn't even have to be gym-based. But use what nature has given you. You were built for physical activity, you were designed to lead and hunt. Training helps grow your masculine frame, not just physically but mentally and also hormonally, testosterone. Endurance training and resistance training, such as weightlifting, both boost testosterone levels briefly. Lifting weight or doing other strength training workouts has a bigger effect on your testosterone. He says the following strategies will give you an even bigger boost in testosterone from your strength training workouts, which is backed up by research. Use more muscles. For instance, a full body workout affects this hormone more than doing one exercise, such as biceps curls. Lift heavier weights rather than doing many reps of light weights. Have shorter rest periods during your workout. Environment. Get competitive. Surround yourself with other driven, masculine men. Studies in epigenetics show that we are a product of our environment, including the people we surround ourselves with. This is thought to be a survival mechanism, you don't want to be the weakest in a group. Say no. Although not absolutes, generally speaking men tend to be more disagreeable and inversely, women agreeable. This is because of testosterone's role in aggression and assertiveness. By learning to say no more often, you're encouraging behavior that requires you to go towards potential conflict and assert yourself as the winner. Get some goals. Having clear goals will allow you to channel your masculine energy. Stay on your mission and try to provide value to society. Self-improve. Meditate, practice self-discipline, no fap. Improving yourself, even just marginally every day will have you become the man you were supposed to be. With the power of the compound effect, you can expect to only get better with age. Be courageous. Take the risk. Confront your fears. You were designed to seek new land, to lead, to protect. See fear as an opportunity for growth, to be a man.